Good morning. This is Mike Ramos uh, with Coldwell Banker here in Reno, Nevada. Today is Tuesday, September 8th, and today I'll be bringing you the August housing report for the city of Reno and Sparks. Uh, first, before we get into the numbers, I want to talk a little bit about uh, mortgage interest rates. According to my friends over at whitecharts.com, the average mortgage interest rate for a 30-year um, fixed rate mortgage is 2. 91%, which is in record territory. Uh, in fact, if you go over to the right here, 15-year mortgage rate, uh, you can get for about two point, uh, a little less than 2.5%. So uh, interest rates are very low. And as I've always said, low interest rates translates to a benefit to both sellers and buyers. If you're a seller, uh, this translates into more a buyers being able to qualify for a loan to buy your home. If you're a buyer, this means that you can, your buying power is increased, meaning that you can buy a little bit bigger home uh, and uh, you can be more competitive with your offers. So let's now get into the numbers for uh, Reno and Sparks. And these numbers are for uh, single family homes. They don't involve uh, condominiums townhomes, manufactured, modular, or new construction. Let's first to talk about new listings. And again, these are new listings for the month of August. We have six, 666 listings in August. This is down about 12.5% from the same time last year. Units sold, about the same 644 units uh, sold in August versus 624 the same time last year. New contracts, that is uh, sellers who put their home on the market and have actually received an accepted offer, 794. That's a, a big increase from the same time last year of almost 33% um, increase. Days to contract, as you might imagine, with this very competitive market that we're in, it's, it it's, uh, takes a very short period of time to get into contract. So the average uh, days to contract, 36 days versus uh, 44 uh, days for the same time last year, which is a reduction um, of about a little over 18% from the same time last year. Median sale price, as you can imagine, an important topic, almost $445,000 uh, for single family homes for the month of August. This is an increase about 11.5% uh, from the same time last year. Last year, we were about 399,000. So a steady increase in pricing. A percent of asked uh, price received, meaning that the accepted price versus what you list the price for, uh, sellers are getting about 99.5%. Uh, so almost, five, let's say, for the sake of argument, 100% of what they're, uh, what they're asking. So as long as you price your house competitively, it's going to sell within about a month for a hundred percent of what you asked for. And that's pretty, pretty darn good. Um, active inventory. We're, we're down, as you can see, we're, we have 545 houses on the market in Reno and Sparks. Uh, this is down almost 64%. From this same time last year, this tra translates into a, a, a big void of active listings. So if you're thinking of selling, now is a great time uh, to get top dollar for your house. To give you an example, uh, I'm going to take one of my listings. Uh, I've got a tenant that's moving out in the end of September. We're going to get in there in about two weeks, uh, get it in tip-top shape, put it on the market. Because right now, I think I can get top dollar for that home. Month supply of inventory, 0.8% uh, uh, or 0.8 month supply of inventory. The normal market uh, months of inventory is about five to six months supply. Uh, we're down below one month supply. So as you can imagine, uh, we're, we're in a very short supply. And this is compared to uh, two and a half, about two and a half month supply in August of last year. So what do these numbers tell you? Number one, price is up. Number two, inventory down. Uh, number three, 
uh, your sellers are getting about 100% of uh, what they're asking. So this is a darn good time to, to put your house in the market. If you're a buyer, this is a great time to, to come in and understand that it's going to be very competitive out there. You're probably going to be dealing with multiple offers on the same house. Uh, so don't be afraid to go with a an aggressive price on that uh, on that house. I'm not saying that you should pay more than what you feel comfortable with, but now is not the time uh, to be bargain hunting. This is not the market for that. Anyway, hopefully this uh, information is useful. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me. As always, my information is at the bottom of this email. Thank you and have a, a safe rest of the week. Have a great day.